children here we have to simplify this there are two brackets containing three three terms each now in this particular if we see in this particular question if we see we have tan secant cot and cosecant how many different ratios are there with us four there are four different ratios which are being used in this question and looking at these four trigonometric ratios suppose i am doing it for the first time i may start scratching my head how to proceed so what i am going to do is i know i know that teacher told us that backbone of trigonometry is sin and cos and all the remaining four ratios can be expressed in the term of, in the form of sin and cos so now this idea clicks me and i am going to change all the ratios to the backbones so that the scratching will be little less than that now there are not four ratios but only two so let us try changing these four to those four. those two bit of one will remain as it is tan can be put as sin upon cos cos secant is written as One upon cos. Change everything to sine and cos beta. Again in the next bracket, one as it is. Cot. Reciprocal of tan. Tan is sine upon cos. So cot will be cos theta upon sine theta. And cos it is reciprocal of sine. So it's going to be one upon sine theta. Okay. So now out of these four are gone, and the new two ratios are in the picture sine and cos. And I'm little comfortable now because instead of four, I have to work on just two ratios now. All right, beta. Now in the first bracket, I have cos theta in the denominator. This one can be written as one upon one. Likewise. This one can be written as one upon one. So in the first bracket, I shall take LCM, and the LCM will be one and cos theta. What is the LCM of one and cos theta, children? Cos theta. Cos theta. Cos theta. Cos theta. Now denominator we divide, numerator we multiply. So cos theta divided by one. Cos theta. And cos theta multiplied by one cos theta, so I am cos. getting theta here. Now here cos theta divided by cos theta will remain same one, and one, one into sine theta sine theta. Here it will be one. Children, I hope LCM is clear. If not, you may ask me. It is something like when you are taking one plus three by four. Seven upon four. You take four as LCM. Four divided by one, four. Four into four, four. And these two remain as it is, because already four is there in the denominator, right? So that is what I have done here. In the next bracket, LCM of one and sine will be sine theta. Likewise, this one will become sine theta, cos theta as it is, plus one. Okay. Now I'm going to use this thing that a upon b into c upon b is equal to a c upon b d. This is how we multiply numerator with numerator, denominator with denominator. So here in the denominator, children. We have got cos theta into sine theta. Cos theta into sine theta. This is minus one children. So cos theta into sine theta is cos theta into sine theta. Now how are we going to simplify the numerator? For simplifying the numerator, each term of bracket one. Will be multiplied by each term of bracket two. So let us first multiply with cos theta. So this is cos theta into sine theta. 
तो कॉस थीटा साइन थीटा कॉस थीटा इंटू कॉस थीटा वुड मेक इट कॉस स्क्वायर थीटा एंड कॉस थीटा इंटू माइनस वन बिकम्स माइनस कॉस थीटा ओके देन साइन थीटा विल बी मल्टीप्लाइड विद दिस ब्रैकेट सो व्हेन यू मल्टीप्लाई दिस विद साइन थीटा साइन थीटा इंटू साइन थीटा मेक्स इट साइन स्क्वायर थीटा साइन थीटा इंटू कॉस थीटा तो प्लस साइन थीटा कॉस थीटा साइन थीटा इंटू माइनस वन दैट मेक्स इट माइनस साइन थीटा ओके एंड इन दी एंड दिस वन विल बी मल्टीप्लाइड बाय ऑल द थ्री टर्म्स so 1 into sin theta makes it sin theta 1 into cos theta makes it cos theta and 1 into minus 1 is minus 1 children now let us see if anything can be cancelled in the numerator bataiye nam cos and minus cos and cos sin cos and sin i mean sin no sin children it's sin So cos minus and plus cos theta. Ma sine no. Minus sine theta plus sine theta. Cancel. Acha. What is AB plus BA? What is AB plus BA, children? Two AB. Is it two AB? Two AB. Yes, ma'am. It is. So that is what we are going to do here. cos theta sin theta plus sin theta cos theta will make it 2 cos theta sin theta okay then we have this cos square theta plus sin square theta written together cos square theta plus sin square theta and this minus 1 is also there so minus 1 divided by cos theta sin theta now children What is cos square theta plus sine square theta? One. Tan theta. Tan theta. Huh? Who is that? Huh? Cos square theta plus sine square theta is an identity which is equal to one. So cos square theta plus sine square theta is one. And what is one minus one? Zero. 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 This is gone. So we are just left with. Two cos theta, sine theta, divided by cos theta, sine theta. Now cos theta, sine theta, and cos theta, sine theta would get cancelled, and we are simply left with two. 